Hello everyone, myself Monica and I am a legal intern in Lexis and Company and today's topic is private international law. Private international law also known as conflict of laws and it is a branch of law that deals with the legal dispute involving foreign elements. It governs the legal relationship between individuals, corporations and other entities that are connected to more than one legal jurisdiction. The main objective of private international law is to provide rules and principles to for determining with, within juri, which jurisdiction's law should apply to a particular case. Private international law addresses various issues that arise in border transaction or disputes including jurisdiction, choice of law, recognition and enforcement of foreign judgments, family, mat family law matters, international commercial transactions, jurisdiction. It determines which country's uh, court should have the authority to hear and decide a case. Jurisdiction can be based on factors such as dependent's residence, where the contract was formed or where the harmful event occurred. Choice of law. Private international law determines which country's law should govern the substantive issue of a case. For example, in a contract dispute between parties from different countries, the question of law countries, the question would be which country's law should be applicable for resolving the dispute, recognition and enforcement of foreign judgments. Private international law provides rules for recognizing and enforcing judgments issued by foreign courts. This ensures that a judgment obtained in one country can be enforced in another. Family law matters. Private international law addresses issues such as marriage, divorce, child custody and adoption when they involve individuals from different countries. It determines which laws, uh, country's law should govern these matters and facilitate the recognition and enforcement of family law jurisdictions. International commercial transactions. Private international law plays a crucial role in international business transactions. It helps determine which jurisdictions law apply uh, to contracts, resolve conflicts in the interpretation of contractual terms and facilitates the enforcement of contractual rights and obligations. Private international law is not a unified law uh, body of law but rather a collection of rules and principles developed through international conventions, treaties, national legislations and court decisions. Each court may have its own set of private international rules but there are also international conventions and agreements that promote uniformity and coordination among different legal systems. And with that I would like to wind up my topic and if you guys are uh, having any uh, doubt or query you can ask me in the comments.